Uh, first signal of the day. Actually, second signal of the day. War nickel. Love digging war nickels. Silver for the day. My other camera's on the kaputza, so I'm. Uh, this camera, the sound's kind of messed up, so I gotta take it home and edit the sound, so that's why you're not hearing. Uh, me detecting, but it's a uh, 1945P war nickel. Love digging the war nickels. It's about seven inches in the ground. Ring in on my AT around a 68. You know, I dig anything over a 45. So, but there you go. Next signal, uh, ringing right over a pull tab, 57, 58. And what do we have here? Cannabis pendant. Cannabis bling. For those that uh, like bling, there's some cannabis bling. Interesting piece. Not often do I dig uh, cannabis pendants. Unusual piece. But I'll keep it. About five inches. Uh, I dug six wheat pennies today. This is just one of them. I normally don't film the wheat pennies. Every wheat penny I dug uh, is pretty well toasty. I think I got the date off of one of them, the common 1944 Wheatie. But, uh, six wheat pennies today. Not a bad day. I hunted two different spots. And, uh, got my silver for the day, so I'm happy with that. But, like I said, I normally don't film wheat pennies. I keep them. But I don't film them often. So uh, clean up on uh, War Nickel. As you can see, it's a 1945 in reasonably good shape. Thing was uh, about seven inches, maybe eight. Ring in real solid though. And it's a P mint mark, as you can see from here. Nice shape. A little worn, but uh, put it in with the rest of my. Uh, it's my fifth war nickel I've dug. And here we have the uh, cannabis bling. Um, I don't know, man. You never know what's coming out of the ground, do you? But, interesting hunt. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.